My name is Matt Needham and I am a part of Students for Liberty. Students for Liberty provides a unified, student-driven form of support for student leaders and student groups all over the world who care about the ideas of liberty. What started out as a roundtable discussion of 13 students in 2008 has turned into a huge and growing global movement of young people who care about liberty. And it's not just their own rights they're standing up for. It's the rights of their peers, their family members, and strangers from all over the world. Um, right now, I'm at the National Conference of Estudantes Pel Libertade, um, our brothers and sisters in Brazil who have taken up the mantle of liberty in their home country. And it's really encouraging for me to see um, their intellectual exploration. They're getting to know the ideas of liberty from economics to philosophy, uh, foreign policy and communication skills. Um, the students that I've met here at the National Conference of Brazil are truly impressive. Um, I first got involved with Students for Liberty at my university, Michigan State University, where I found a college libertarians student group, except that group was really just one person. Um, I joined with him, his name was Colin, and we grew from two students to 15 in just a year. Um, holding reading groups to read about Mises and Hayek, um, organizing on campus to fight against uh, war and crony capitalism, and trying to get other students involved in what we thought, thought was important for public policy, the ideas of libertarianism, uh, limited government, uh, fiscal responsibility, and natural human rights. Um, and in my work with students all over the world, from Africa to South America, Europe, Asia, Australia, and New Zealand, they all come around this common theme of limited government, of human rights. So we found that the ideas of liberty um, are pretty constant throughout the world. Their understanding might be informed by their local context, but it's all the same message. And the strategies for spreading them are similar too forming some sort of student group and spreading the message on campus. And also, what's really cool to see in the 21st century is this international community of people who were able to connect through Facebook, Gmail, WhatsApp, to form groups like Students for Liberty, Estudantes Pel Libertade, and our other brothers and sisters around the world. So, if you're interested in becoming a part of Estudantes Pel Libertade, I think you definitely should. It's a really exciting community of young people who care about learning and developing knowledge for a free and prosperous society. I've really enjoyed my time here getting to know these students, and I'm proud to be a member of the Global Students for Liberty family.